going to hang with that? I think it's in. <laughs> Grace and Ruby are going on a competition and I wish them very good luck. <laughs> Talking to the camera. <laughs> Was she squeaking? Yeah. She sounds like a pig. <laughs> Yeah, but it's a good job it's hitting. Yeah, oh, you can be quite nosy. How do buses turn? Yeah. Question of the day. And statement of the day. We don't live on Earth. We live on the universe's floor. The carpet of the universe. Chubs. Where are we going? You're stable. Rue? Okay, yeah. Uh, anyway, let's go feed.
That's where I realized that you can <laughs> nice try. So we're at Widmere, and like we really like the venue. Like the arenas don't look too spooky, which is a bonus. No, Massive there's no bonus. It's like it's like the arena itself is just like a re and an arena. It's not like if you get I don't know if I'm making much sense. There's no but there's no arena like in an arena. Fence. It's you just can't go around the outside. Like when you go in to like trot around, like that is your arena. So you're actually in the arena that you're gonna do your testing. It's so not like the arena. I don't know. I don't know if that makes sense, but no, I, don't I know what I mean. Then we settled the horses in, did stables and stuff. It's fine, we rode, yeah. stretched them. I was happy with that. But the most exciting thing is, is that we've got the telly to work, so we can watch Strictly. Oh, well, that's very well. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is my like favourite thing, Strictly. <laughs> Mum's on the phone, so she's missing out on Strictly. Because do you know what's on after? I'm Have a going guess. to bed? No. I've got to watch Casualty. Oh no, I'm going to bed. Okay then. I'll go in the corner and go to sleep. But to be fair though, Ru Ruby has the earliest time She's the first person at the centre line out the whole day. Mm. She's in at 8.30. Yeah, but the, I've got to do the arena walk at 7. Yeah, we're both going to do the arena walk at 7am. So... It means, like... Like, he's going to have his breakfast at, like, half five. Not half five! Yeah, because he's going to have, like, hot water bottles on. No, oh, about six-ish, about six-ish. But we'll have to be, like, getting up at probably half five-ish. But, hey, I'm used to that, because I do that when I go to school. However, Ruby... <laughs> maybe a bit of a challenge! Well, I'll, I'll get up. Fine. I actually, I, I doubt that you will. You will not get up no, at 5.30. Well. You will not. Mm, it's my first um, away show with him. It is. First overnighter with Mickey. It's going well so far. You haven't done anything He's yet. very cuddly at the moment. Ponies are plattered as well. He was very cuddly. Mouse went to sleep when I plattered her. Aww. Mickey was very cuddly. No night, Mousy. Just grumpy. No night. <laughs> Sally, this one's for you because you're not on the video. We miss you. <laughs> Mickey doesn't look that enthusiastic, does he? <laughs> no. Uh, I thought it was too good for the train. I know, so did I. But the rest of her is pretty. You got the state, she got one on the side. Well. No. Good morning. It is actually such a nice day today. I'm really excited to be riding today. Anyway, this morning we got up at around 6.30 and we fed Mickey and Mouse and just checked on them. They were all fine. And then at 7 we did the arena walk. And to be fair, even though the arena's not that spooky, they were both really good. And right now... It is ten past eight and Ruby is currently warming up and then I just came back to just grab a few things from here and just get changed really because I was actually still in my pyjamas. <laughs> but yeah, that's currently what's happening so I will take you along with me as Ruby warms up. I take the break
bright soul dressed ready to compete truth be told looking at the scores coming out today there are some very low scores which means they're marking harshly which is fair enough for a championship it's understandable so I'm feeling a bit nervous truth be told but we'll have to see how it goes so I will let you know after I've written I thought that my test was actually really really nice apart from like a little spook like apart from that like she was really good but then it kind of worked in my favor the spook because when she's like stronger like that I get really good medium trots and canters so I, and I got really really good marks for those looking at my sheet and overall I'm just really pleased we finished fourth it was the top two that qualified, but I was holding third until right at the end, which isn't the end of the world really, but overall I think for a championship class with really harsh marking, I was very, very pleased. And also my friends, Hannah and her family, who live quite local, they, they came to say hi and it was really nice to see them. So we're just re getting ready to go home. Like the horses are loaded and we're just tidying up and mum is just gonna um has just gone to the secretary just to say like we're leaving thank you like for looking after us because the venue was really nice we've been really impressed so then we'll be off home we belong to the start for a moment we're in heaven where we are till we hear the final call let's pretend you'll be forever 